Hi everybody. Um, okay, so I'm here at uh, DC. We're at DC in front of the White House. So, uh, or something. I think it's the White House. Uh, it's got a barricade all around it. So, and do not enter signs um, that we're paying for. But anyway, um, just wanted you to know that we're here and we're doing meetings here, but we're also out kind of getting a lay of the land and seeing what's going on out here. Um, we're getting ready to walk around and um, there's, there's a definite atmosphere change, but you know what's cool is that the earth is still the Lord's and the fullness of it. And that's what I think all of us are expecting and wanting to see. And we know that uh, there's a big change coming always because God is in control. And um, we have to remember that, you know, there's covenant promises that were made years ago um, with our country, with God, and he's a covenant keeping God. So we're gonna be able to see him keep covenant and be able to restore our land as people pray, as they turn and they, and we're waking up to all the things that we've been given to do. He told us to occupy until he comes and that's what we're gonna do. And he said also on every place that your foot treads, every single place you go, he said, I've given it to you. So we're walking with intentionality and with um, being able to, to take back what God has entrusted us for our country. So um, I just, the motorcade went by not too long ago. Uh, there was a bunch of, uh, I, I didn't even know what it was. You know, I heard a bunch of sirens and things. And so there were like a hundred motorcycles and then all of a sudden the motorcade went by. So um, we are, we are definitely going to, uh, to see God move in. There's certain things we can do and there's certain things that God will do. So there's a sovereignty thing as well as uh, our responsibility, you know, to be able to, to stand for what God stands for. And that is for freedom and for, uh, for people to be a, a nation, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. So I know I sound like a postcard or some kind of, I don't know, we went in the gift shop and I was like, I can't buy anything in here. Um, but I'm telling you, he's he's got this, he's got this. And there's a lot of people out here today. There's a lot of, if you can see uh, the White House, I'll show it to you um, right there. And again, you can't even get close. You can't even get near. I don't even know if they're doing tours anymore or any of that, but um, we're getting ready to walk down to the Capitol building as well. We just saw the Treasury building, and um, and I think the atmosphere um, here is strained. It feels like people know that there's things off, but um, God's an atmosphere shifter, so that's always hopeful, and it gives us the ability to know that you know he's gonna he's gonna do some stuff i mean i've watched him do this before at different places and now we're getting ready to see him do it here so i think it's an appointed time i think i'm here and abby and i both are here for an appointed time uh, right now so uh, we're doing some declarations and some some intentional declarations uh, partnering with heaven who's already got it figured out and we're gonna see God do manifestations on the earth that's gonna bring things back into perspective and what we're what this is really meant to be. And so I just wanted to give you the update on on us being here. It's cold, nose is running, so um but people are I'll, I'll keep you updated. How's that? I'm going to keep you updated on what we see and what we're picking up while we're walking around out here because we're really listening. I want to hear. I want to hear from heaven. I don't want to hear from people. I want to hear from God. What is it? What's up? You know, where are you at with this? And we're, what's the timetable? And what are you looking for? And how do you want us to position ourselves to, to exercise your kingdom on this earth just like it is in heaven? So... All right, guys, I love you, and I will talk with you soon. I have to blow my nose. Okay, bye.